uh, the CBI is conducting raids on the residences of uh, senior uh, Supreme Court lawyer Indra Jai Singh and uh, her husband, uh, uh, advocate Anand Grover. They're both being investigated for having a case had been filed by the CBI against them for alleged violations of uh, the FCRA. That's in receiving uh, foreign funds for their NGO uh, lawyers collective. Uh, the case had been filed earlier by the CBI and now the news coming that raids are being conducted at Indra Jai Singh's residence and office as well. We'll try and get you more details on that. Now, uh, they were issued a notice uh, as well over this issue. Well, let's go across to Arvind for those details. Arvind, now this case had been filed earlier. Now this morning, raids are being conducted at the residence and office of Indira Jai Singh. Yeah, Gargi, the Central Bureau of Investigation on June 13th filed a case against uh, lawyers, collective and NGO, and also they have also named Anand Grover as an accused in that said FIA. The, the agency, uh, based on the complaint from the Union Home Ministry, had registered this FIR on June 13th. And what we are hearing from our sources in the Central Bureau of Investigation is that the Central Bureau of Investigation officials are conducting raids at the office premises of lawyers, collective, the NGO. They are also uh, conducting raids at the uh, residence premises of Indra Jai Singh, the senior advocate, and also Anand Grover, senior advocate in Delhi. And what we are also hearing is that the agency is also conducting raids at the uh, premises linked to lawyers collective in Mumbai also. So uh, we spoke to Anand Grover, senior advocate, who was also named in this particular affair, and he told us that he has confirmed that the raids are uh, underway from morning 6 a.m., but he is not ready to comment anything more. When we spoke to other officials of the Central Bureau of Investigation, they tell us that they based on a complaint from the Union Home Ministry that lawyers collective violating the uh, FCRA, that is Foreign Contribution Regulation Act, they had received around 32.3 crores uh, from 2005 to 2013 uh, from several uh, funding uh, 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 from abroad and they violated the norms. They used the money for their own personal uh, causes and they also used this money for other uh, uh, causes which are in violation of the FCRA. So based on that particular complaint from the Union Home Ministry, the agency had registered an FIR and today they are conducting raids at several places linked to uh, Indra Jai Singh and also Anand Grover. What we are hearing is that Indra Jai Singh, senior advocate Indra Jai Singh is not in Delhi. Gargi? All right, and Arvind, we have seen, uh, you know, in, in uh, the NDA one government as well, this this uh, this clamping down on foreign funds for NGOs. This is something that the government had really gone after, and now uh, this case against Indira Jai Singh, and she is a known critic, in fact, of this government. Gargi, it's very important because there have been several cases of several complaints regarding the same violation of FCR, and the Union Home Ministry has uh, scrapped, has banned uh, several NGOs. But this is the first time, this is in fact the second time, the Central Bureau of Investigation is registering a case against an NGO for FCRA violation. There are only two cases in the history by the Central Bureau of Investigation they have, reg they have registered against NGOs. One is Deepak Talwar led uh, uh, NGO. Second one is this NGO, that is Lawyers Collective, which is being headed by Indra Jai Singh and also Anand Grover. Incidentally, interestingly, when the Central Bureau of Investigation registered this FIR, they have also invoked the Prevention of Corruption Act. They have registered an, a case against an NGO for FCRA violation, but they have also invoked the Prevention of Corruption Act. They have, they have, what they are saying is that when this particular offence took place, that time Indra Jai Singh was a government servant. She was, uh, she was, uh, she was an uh, as AASG, Additional Solicitor General. So in that case, they have also invoked the Prevention of Corruption Act. This we have to wait and watch how the case pans out in the court. But what we are also hearing is that a similar matter against this particular case is also pending before the Supreme Court. But based on the complaint from the Union Home Ministry, the Central Bureau of Investigation has gone ahead. They have registered an FIR and today they are conducting the raid.